Hey, what's up? I am Shelby, and you guys know that I'm all about simplifying my life, making things easier. In the past year or two, I have simplified my space like a freaking professional, if I do say so myself, through following the life changing magic of tidying up last year and doing my own Simplify Your Life challenge that at the start of this year. And on reflection, all of that simplifying has made a huge impact on every other area of my life even my YouTube channel. Lately, I've been working more towards simplifying my days, giving myself more free time, trying to make my days less busy and hectic and have more free time to do things that I wanna do. So if that's something that you guys are also working towards, I've put together a bunch of concepts and ideas that I'm going to talk about in this video on how to keep your days a little bit more simplified. So firstly, know what you enjoy, know what you don't enjoy and prioritize accordingly. It sounds so simple, but this is something that I need to remind myself of regularly. Figure out what you enjoy doing. For some prompts, revisit day 17 of my Simplify Your Life Challenge, which is figuring out what lights you up. I'll leave the link in the description below. Then when you get invited to do something that doesn't align with what you enjoy doing, or you consider taking on something that doesn't light you up, don't do it. Learn how to say, I won't be able to make it, or I don't wanna do that, but I will do this and your days will become a whole lot simpler. Use your best time to do your best work. I work best from 5.30 in the morning to 9 o'clock a.m. That is when I am most focused, that's when I'm most in flow, that's when I'm most likely to do my video planning. From 9 o'clock I can still do good stuff but as soon as I hit about 12 my flow turns into more like a trickle unless I am like super motivated, super inspired, something's got me going and lit me on fire. And I am okay with that, I have learnt to work with it. Knowing when your best thinking time and your best work working time or your best creative time is in the day helps you to totally prioritize your day according to when your energy shifts. You can simplify and prioritize. Eliminate as many decisions from your day as you can. One of the best things that decluttering my space did for me is just eliminating the amount of decisions that I need to make in a day. I barely have to think when I get dressed for work because I have a few go-to outfits. All of my clothes kind of go with each other. All of my pens are the same. Don't have to think when I'm grabbing for a pen. I'm not joking and I love it. My mugs are all the shape that I like, so I don't have to spend my decision-making energy in choosing what mug to pick for my coffee in the morning, which, yes, is something that I used to spend my decision-making energy on. Think through a normal day view and write down all of the teeny tiny little decisions that you have to make and think about how you can cut down those decisions. How can you eliminate the need to make that decision at all or make the decision a lot easier? Next up is make simpler food. This kind of rides on the coach of making less decisions. The minute that I let go of my guilt about not being a good cook, my life got like 1,000 times simpler. I feel like I actually let that guilt go a long time ago because I am definitely not like a cooking oriented person. I don't enjoy it. But like the past year, maybe two, I've stopped like even considering putting a lot of effort into my food and I've really embraced simple eating. Now I try to make food that only takes a very short time to make, but all tastes reasonably good and it's pretty nutritious. One thing I do do and I've done for like ever is my breakfast is the same every single day so I never go to the kitchen of a morning and I'm like oh what am I gonna cook for breakfast if you're interested it was oats for like three years and now it's muesli theme your days this might not be relevant to everyone but if you can theme your days and focus on one thing each day it will make your life a lot simpler so for me I might have a day where I focus on planning videos I might have a day where I focus on filming and then a day where I focus on editing it doesn't always work out that way depending on how my weekends go but I find doing tasks in bulk is a lot easier than switching up on a bunch of different tasks in one day. You can really put all of your energy and all of your focus into the one thing. Plan your days the night before. I won't hop on about this too much because I've talked to it before, but planning what you want to do the night before is a really easy way to just streamline your next day and it reduces that kind of friction that you have about, oh, what am I gonna do for the day? You eliminate your need to like make that decision when you wake up. You wake up just knowing exactly what you have to do and you get to it. It makes your day so much simpler. And do less. Make sure what you're doing is actually beneficial to you. Avoid busy work. Think about what you spend your time on in a day and then think about how what you spent time on is benefiting you. Whether what you get is results, happiness, peace, growth, money, whatever. Cut out the stuff that doesn't give you anything or only gives you very little and do less. So those are some of the ways that I've been working to simplify my day, simplify my life. If you guys have anything that you've been doing lately to keep things simple, please leave your comments in the comment section down below. Follow me on Instagram if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you guys so very much and I will see you soon.